Hi and welcome to Bits of Android. My name's Nick. This time around I wanted to um, show you what I've done with um, my HP touchpad. Um, I've installed Cyanogen Mod on it and um, it's running um, Android 2.3.7 um, and the Cyanogen Mod build is um, Alpha 3. I started off with Alpha 2 and then upgraded to Alpha 3. Um, I found it to be a really good experience. Um, there's been a few little issues with freezing and crashes, but by and large, um, it's been a great experience. Um, no real problems at all. Um, the only persistent problem I've seen is um, that with playing music, um, if the screen, um, as as you just saw, goes to timeout, then what happens is um, the music distorts badly. Um, and you have to bring open the screen again, um, just like this, and um, then the music goes back to normal. So that's the only major problem I've found with it. Um, the the uh, background wallpaper I'm running there, a live wallpaper, that really sucks the battery, um, but it's pretty cool. So what we've got up here, um, I've just sort of customised it a little bit. So this menu you can see um, that starts in the bottom and over on the left, but I've put it up in the top right. And that's the great thing about Cyanogen Mod is you can really customise it how you want it. I've got the battery there as a number rather than as um, an indicator of how low the battery is. So it connects well to Wi-Fi. It connects to my phone's Wi-Fi. I have a Samsung Galaxy S2. It connects really easily to that um, when I'm out and about um, and another great thing was um, with the Android market um, I signed in with the same account that I have on my phone and all the apps I paid for on my phone they synced over to the tablet um, or rather I could download them for free on the tablet it said I'd already paid for them um, so that was that was really nice and easy um, so yeah this is the second build I've had look forward to future builds of um, Cyanogen Mod um, and yeah I would recommend it to anybody this is my touch droid thank you